Hello, welcome to the awesome adventures of Captain Spirit. So, this is, right, as far as I understand, this is the prequel to Life is Strange 2, which is not a sequel to Life is Strange. I think that's right. So, Life is Strange 2 is coming, I'm not sure when. This is the prequel to it. This is the intro, I guess, I'm not exactly sure. But, um, and I don't, I don't know... <laughs> I don't know exactly what to expect, so it'll be good to just jump in. So let's do it. So this is a free game. Um, I've got it on free on the PlayStation, so I think it'll be free on other platforms as well um spirit of my silence kind of like a demo i guess you, but i'm afraid to be near you and i don't know where to begin sorry just turn the volume down a little bit there i think see if i don't find out until like i watch it back whether everything's okay or not i should probably find a more professional way of doing this but i'm already getting life is strange vibes with this music. To begin? It was one of the like staples of Life is Strange, wasn't it? Like they always had this music set in the vibe. Not this music, but you know what I mean? What is this planet? I don't know, we've never been here before. Maybe we're on the edge of the universe. Hey, cool. Let's see if we can find some aliens. Hey, the ground is moving. The planet's gonna eat us. We have to get back to the ship right now. Then let's get the heck out of here. Oh no, the control panel's not working. We're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Hold on. Let me just give you a hand. Wait, so he doesn't have like powers? Because the controller was vibrating like crazy right there. No, it's just me, Captain Spirit, who can bend all matter to his will. I did it. I still got the power. So confused. Now I just need to make a cool costume for Captain Spirit. I gotta have a cool cape to fly. Good thing I have one. Mask or no mask? Secret identity or not? Hmm. Helmet. I think helmet's a yep, good choice. Looks cool so far. Let's see. <laughs> what about the armor? Hmm. If he's gonna be flying, he should have light armor now. <laughs> well, I guess unless you're like Iron Man so and then you have heavy cool. armor. <laughs> Though. Should he be dark? Or colorful. Colorful. Of course. The art is like very so much like Life is Strange as well. Like this little kid looks very much like Max. 
Beware, Mantroid. Watch out. That's not Captain very colorful. Spirit is ready for battle. The awesome adventures of Captain Spirit. I wonder what this is going to be about. Like, this is the thing. Hello, Saturday morning. I can do anything I want today. Oh, I love that feeling. Cool. Okay, we're in. Hmm. I can do a training session with my power. Training session? Right, let's see what your wish list is. This isn't greedy. Right, Santa? Plus, Dad will love that I want basketball lessons. Dear Santa Claus, I think I have been good. Here is my list for Christmas, smiley faces, hearts. Uh, hot dog adventures. Play. I can't read that. Wait. Ah. Hot dog adventures. Play box. Play box console. Black. John paper and pens. Basketball lessons. Sincerely, Chris. Love heart. So we're Chris. Okay. Uh, oops. This isn't greedy. Right, Santa? Plus, Dad will love that I want basketball lessons. At least the forest warrior protect me from the snow ghost. I do like these games, how, like, interactive. You, like, how there's little details, and you don't usually need all the details, but it's nice to look at them. Dad took away my firecrackers when I blew up the garbage can last year. <laughs> hmm. I wonder where he hid them. I never had firecrackers. I don't even know what they are. What kind of a Viking would I be? Ralph the Viking. Console. Dad said he was going to fix that last month. Oh, is it broken? Right. Cool, kid. Only my brain waves can activate the monitor. That is an old TV. Ooh, ooh, what was that? Oh, I missed it. Ah! <laughs> I don't know what keeps coming across the top of the screen. I keep missing it. That was a fun birthday party at Pizza Arcade. I hope that it'll be cool next year. Pizza Arcade. Best player of the day, Chris, we won. Nice. 43. He's definitely a, a, a bit of a gamer and a bit of a, a bit of a nerd. Advent calendar. Mmm, chocolate. Thanks, Claire. Eat, of course. What? Jeez, good job, chocolate hog. <laughs> oh dear, did we eat ahead? Oh, and okay, so it. I was thinking. Uh. Be right there. Oh man, we're out of time. I was thinking, like, it seems too sunny to be Christmas. <laughs> Gotta have a super cape. Only Captain Spirit can wear it. What keeps popping up at the top? Oh, oh, wait, there. Ugh. Slippers. Let me look. No superhero should wear those. They are nice They're slippers. So comfy. I would wear them slippers, but I'm not a superhero. <laughs> Mom bought me so many cool comic books. She told me never throw them away. I won't. Chris, no. I need now. Wait, I'm not finished. Oops. This is Chris to the Flying Fortress. Come in, come in. <laughs> Roger, I'm here. I hope so, Sky Pirate. What do you see up there? Have you spotted Snowmancer? Not yet. It's hard because of the storm. This is perfect cover for a Snowmancer sneak attack. 
I sharp. Keep me posted. Yes, sir. Roger that. <laughs> Thanks, Sky Pirate. Over and out. I know you're out there, Snowmancer. He's very cute. This kid. Uh. Watch out, supervillains. Today I make my own superhero costume. Uh. Every superhero team needs a supervillain team. <laughs> Fuck. So glad I did my English homework already. Miss Stroud's pretty nice, and she likes my stories. Chris, I mean now. I'm coming. I'm coming. I won. I know. Oops. Do not make me. I hope I can draw <laughs> as good as mom someday. Hope I can draw as good as mom. Chris, since you're going to be my own superhero, this book is a great start. You can be everything I am not. You can wait to spend... I can't wait to spend the rest of my life watching you save the world. Love forever, super mom. That's adorable. Aww. I guess I should go. Like, I don't... I'm not finished, but... I'm getting wrong of my parents, I'm guessing. Hey, Chris, you better come to breakfast when I holler at you, or else we're gonna have a problem. But I... Don't. This isn't a hotel, buddy. I got things to do. Oh, chill out, man. Oh yeah, so we're just sitting here doing nothing anyway. Like, why couldn't he be in his bedroom? Miserable. Scrambled egg on toast? Is that beer? Tell me that's not beer. <sighs> What'd you expect? A waffle? Uh, uh, I like mom. I just like sunny side up. Like mom used to make. Oh, don't say mom's yeah. dead. Me too. That's not gonna happen. I know. You can't keep saying mom used to do this or that. I know more than anybody, Chris. I know. Okay? Yeah. Okay. I'm calling him out. Drinking beer? Before you eat? Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's game day. Dads are allowed to drink early. Hey, I don't need a lecture from my son. Thanks. Oh, I hate this guy. I, I don't drink that much. I mean, what am I supposed to do in this fucking town? Go to church like all these assholes? You wanna watch your Sorry. language, you know? Don't swear, okay? I don't. Superheroes don't swear. <laughs> Looks like I'm off the team. Nah. You're cool. Like Aww. a rebel. <laughs> hey, is your, uh, your arm okay? Looks better. Anybody, yeah. Ask you about it or uh, say anything at all? Um, it hurts. What well, did what did we it do to it? A little. Really? I, I can give you an ice pack and maybe one of my pills. 
No pain and no swelling. Yeah, makes me sad that I... That, that you got hurt. Did you hurt us? It's not that bad, I'm fine. Okay, okay. Won't bother you anymore. So, so you must be excited for Christmas. I'm always excited for Christmas. Hint, hint. <laughs> I was hoping Santa might maybe get me a new console since mine is broken. Then Santa needs to get me a new job. It has to be a console. Basketball costs 10 bucks. Okay. Oh, since it's Saturday, are we gonna get a Christmas tree? You said we could get a real pine. Yes, I did, and yes, we are. But I just want to watch the game before we go, okay? But you always fall asleep. <laughs> I won't today. And if I do, just wake me up and we'll go. Promise. He's been drinking. Okay. He can't drive. You promise? I do. Now go take advantage of your weekend. Perfect weather outside for you to play. Whatever. You're free. Come grab me later. How did such a twat like that have such a precious little son like that? I don't think we're going to end up getting a Christmas tree today. But maybe, I guess. Still, like I say, he shouldn't be driving if he's just been drinking all morning. And I don't know how else you're going to get the tree, because you can't just carry it. <laughs> okay. What would Captain Spirit do? What would Captain Spirit do? My awesome things to do. Oh yes, we've got to make a costume. I can make a costume now. Maybe I can find what I need around. Captain Spirit's treasure is buried here somewhere. I need to assemble the two parts of the map to find the way. Oops. Hmm, I can practice my target skills on these dangerous beer cans. Looks like Snowman wants to destroy our town. Only I can stop him this time. I can't let the water eater defeat me this time. <laughs> I could play Mustard Party too, but I need to unlock Dad's phone. My superhero team is strong, but I better keep my eyes on Mantroid and his supervillains. That's the picture that we looked at in the bedroom, isn't it? I bet Mantroid is still holding is still hiding on his planet. With my full costume, I could use my spaceship and find him. But I like this kid, you know, he's productive, he gets things done. Those dishes definitely need a mega clean. We'll do them just so we can't get shit. Oh man, this is cold. I might have to check out the water ah. heater. Something for dad. Well, that's the beer cans. Ew, sticky beer cans. I'm not putting them in the trash yet because we were looking at shooting them or something. Boring. <laughs> Let's say. Local police face more protests in shooting death. Seattle. Oh, so we're in Seattle. Okay. Is Seattle the rainy one? With the big... Oh wait, no, maybe that's Chicago. I don't know. <laughs> I'm really trying to improve my geography. Seattle. Seattle where I zombie is? No, Seattle is where... Once Upon a Time Season 7 is. 
I'll figure this out. <laughs> Small riots and protests have continued to mount one month after the unexplained deaths of a local man and police officer. An official statement from the police has not been released, but sources say the man may the man appeared to have been shot by the officer while the latter's cause of death remains unknown. Seattle Police Department have been accused by civil rights groups of mishandling the incident, which led to the public protesting and riots. See, I think like things like this often end up being important, so just got to remember that. Um, look at the mess. Ooh, this can make a pretty good helmet. Oh yeah. Be careful with that though, otherwise. What's that saying? Hold L two to see power actions when that icon is displayed. Oh, cool. Okay. I obviously missed something in the bedroom. Uh. Well, it's not okay. exactly. That's a good start. And what I meant. Time to build the rest of my costume. Yeah, it's not exactly what I meant by a um, helmet, but it'll do. Dear Charles, we just wanted to let you know how much we both care about you and Chris. I know life has been hard since Emily left us, but we're still a family and we intend to keep it that way. That includes making sure Chris is getting all the care he needs at this fragile age. We've always been honest with you, so please take our concern as a sign of love, the way you loved our beautiful daughter. So this is the grandparents. We also heard through a friend that you were in some kind of bar fight, but the police declined to arrest you. Thank God, please take care of yourself. To cut to the chase, we want to help, so we hope that you will allow us to take care of Chris for the next year, or as long as you need, and consider joining a support group. That sounds like a good idea. Like, we need to Grandma take and them Grandpa up on this. Are so cool. But no way, I'm ever leaving Dad. No, you need to leave Dad if he treats you well. If he, you know, if he's drinking so much and if he's bruising your arms. We are not judging you in any way. Only showing that we care by offering our home and love to your wonderful son. A letter seems impersonal, but we want you to think without pressure. Forgive us if you feel we have overstepped our bounds. This is only about how much we love you and Chris. We are here for you both, always, Peter. Grandpa Pete. That's where we need to go. <laughs> hmm. I'm just too busy to care if I go online. Shall we have a look? There's my hot dog man. <laughs> I can't see Dad selling homes. Wait, wait, read. Join the revolution. Want to play with Hot Dog Man? Take a picture of your kid covered with mustard and send it over. Lots of Hot Dog Man exclusive toys to win every month. What? Why would you cover your kid in mustard? Why would they encourage that? Get a real, no. Get real about your future today. Become a realtor today. Our 10 week course gives you everything you need to start selling homes and making dreams come true. Lisa Avena is the number one real estate agent in the Northwest, featured on NPR and voted Best Realtor 2015. Click here to sign up to receive a 10% discount. Hmm. Whoa, is he getting us tickets again? Best dad ever. Join us, Portland Hero Con 2017, January, so that's like in a few weeks, I guess, after Christmas. Portland City Centre, over 1,000 guest events and dealers. Be a hero, register today. Well, it's not so bad if, like, I mean, well, I shouldn't be jumping to conclusions here. Those bruises does not mean abuse. That would be a blast being a freight hopper. Choo choo. To all employees. Recently, our Beaver Creek field officers have received multiple complaints about unruly teenage freight hoppers in the area. 
They have a minor reputation around the northwest, so please do not let them provoke you into a confrontation. Instead, if you encounter any problems or situation involving this group, please report it immediately to your supervisor. If you have any questions, please contact me during office hours. Thank you. Mike Stevenson, Operations Supervisor, Northwest Railway. So, freight hoppers, is that like jumping on the cart or something? Never heard of it. <laughs> I really need to get an education. Oh, those are dad's pages. Stat world, search, players, team, season scores. Yeah, it's like basketball, looking at the picture. Oh yeah, and he wants us to learn basketball, so Damn, you're on fire. cool. I'm sure I can beat my high score on Mustard Party too. Yeah, we'll just leave that for now, kid. We'll make your outfit first. I don't want to go too close to him in case. Chris, these are the most important numbers for you on this list. Oh yeah. <laughs> cool story, Dad. Pizza shop, Reynolds. I don't know what Reynolds is. And Dad's cell phone. I guess we'll need them later. Oh, we can phone. <laughs> are we going to phone? What the fuck is this? Open your goddamn eyes. I can pick up all the beer cans so we can recycle. Yeah, let's recycle them. It's early, but I can make Dad some mac and cheese. He's too lazy, and he won't eat anything. Let's make him some mac and cheese. Beginning countdown to launch. Five. Oh, look at the microwave. Four, three. Two, one. Cool. We can trash these in the recycle box. The beer can monster cannot be. Mm. Seriously? <laughs> Aww. Dad's going shopping. What are we going to get? Sugar, paper, battery, coffee, beer, milk, barbecue chips. Yeah, let's add ice cream. Let's see. What do we need? <laughs> let's have another look at that. That should be enough. Cookie dough ice cream, good choice. Very good choice. I've never seen a beaver around here. Beaver Creek, best damn town in America. <laughs> oh, I like it. I find that quite funny. Let's have another look in the fridge. Milk. Is that moldy? Oh yeah, that's how you dominate. That's it. I must remember to keep an eye out um for that there, the um power button. <laughs> Zap! The awful green things are flushed in this space. <laughs> oh he's so cute. He's such a geek. Fry, bitch. I thought he was gonna say fry, bitch. <laughs> oh, there's six seconds left. Three, two, one. Let's give it to Dad. He better appreciate it. I'm gonna be pissed if he doesn't. Snack time! Did you make that for me? You wouldn't get up during the game, so I thought you could eat out here. I can nuke this mac and cheese in no time. Not bad. Not bad at all. You better start cooking from now on, buddy. 
Mom made the best mac and cheese. I mean... She did make the best mac and cheese. But this is the perfect comfort food for a winter game day. Thanks. Well, you're welcome. Taste it first. Best mac and cheese ever. Aww. Should we just stand there and watch him like eat the whole thing? I don't want to speak to him yet. Um, no, I'm not going to play with the fire. That's my bedroom. Oh no, I hate going to the water eater's lair. Hey, can you get that? Ah, the phone's ringing. Where's it? A answer. Gonna be Granddad uh, Pete. Hello. Good morning, sir. How are you this glorious day? Um. Okay. <laughs> hey, who is that? Who keeps calling? I don't know. Uh, who is this? Thank you for asking, young man. My name is Derek, and I'm a proud member of the Universal Uprising Church. Oh my I'd God. love to tell you and your family about Jesus, our righteous Lord and Savior. Our church just wants you and your loved ones to share the Holy Spirit. Spirit? Um, we're just watching the game. Well, always remember that our Lord is watching out for you. By the way, is your mother or father available to speak? Well, I have to ask first. Chris, who the hell are you talking to? <laughs> Nobody, Dad. Jesus is... <laughs> oh, dear. That was strange. 